Hi guys, welcome back to Fashion School with Nick Varios. In today's video, I'm showing you how to draw a men's fitted jacket. Okay, so in my last video, I showed you guys how to create your very own men's croquis to draw flat sketches. So now you're gonna put that to good use to draw a men's fitted jacket. What are you gonna need? Well, of course you're gonna need that men's croquis. That's number one. Then you're also gonna need a number two pencil to draw on. Also, you can use a mechanical pencil. I like a .7 lead. And a clear ruler, an eraser, and most importantly, a piece of paper to draw on. Now, once you have all those things, you're ready to get started. Okay, so we're gonna do a men's fitted jacket, or other people call it a blazer. It's what I'm wearing right here, a fitted jacket, with a notched lapel or notch collar. That's what this is. In case you're wondering what is a notch collar, notch lapel, it's this, it's got a notch. Do you see the little opening right here? Little opening, that's the notch collar. That's what it differentiates it from the shawl collar, okay? So now you know what I'm gonna draw, and now we're gonna draw it, okay? So as you can see, I have my croquis. This I got from my book, okay? So you can also get it from the book. See, men's croquis front. It's got all the nine heads. We're gonna concentrate right here. Then we're gonna take a piece of paper. See how you can see, look, hi, croquis. I can see on top of it, okay? So then I'm gonna situate my piece of paper and I'm gonna start to draw. Now first, you're gonna draw the collar. That's this part right here. There's a collar and then the lapel. This is all one piece. This is still part of the front. It just goes in, see, look, it goes, See, part of the front. This is not a separate piece. A lot of people may think that's a separate piece. It's not, see? It's all one piece, okay? All right, let's get started. So first thing, right at the neck, right here where you can see the neck, you wanna draw a line. I call it a halo. It's right here where the chin is, the chin level. So draw a straight line right there, just like that. Okay, and then next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna draw this line. See how it crosses over these two lines? So first, pick where that button's gonna go. It's right around the stomach or abdomen. So you're gonna figure where that's gonna go and you're gonna draw the two lines. First, go like this, see? Draw one line and see now, I've gone beyond the center front. Go beyond the center front. Do the same thing for the other line and they'll cross over slightly, just like that. Do you see that, how they cross over? Don't mind that, okay? So next, we're gonna do the lapel. So a little bit below the shoulder. See where the shoulder is? You wanna draw a straight line. Get your ruler and go out, just like that. And then take your ruler and you're gonna do a slightly curved line like that. And I'm gonna do it lightly, just like that. And then you can do it a little more heavy. And it's slightly curved. It's like a knife, okay? Think of it. Now do a mirror image of the same on the other side, okay? And once again, do your curved line, just like that. Look at that, see, look, you've got the two lapels right there, they cross over. You're gonna erase the other one, cause see, you don't see it. I don't know if you see, but you don't see it, okay? So now we're gonna do this, the collar right up here. This is how you're gonna do it. Go up, and then to the shoulder, and then up. Oh, it's a collar! <laughs> do the same thing here, go up, then to the shoulder, and then go here. Oh, and then right at the neck, you see it where the croquis is, see? Right there, you're gonna draw the neck line. Just in a straight line. Look at that. Voila! See, you're drawing your lapel, okay? Now you've got that down. Now let's draw the center front. The center front of the jacket is not I repeat, it's not at the center front of your body. It's a little bit away from it, okay? So I'm gonna draw it right here, go down. Do you notice it's a little bit away? Here's your center front, you wanna draw a little bit away from it, okay? Because it crosses over. And the men's jacket opens differently than the women's, so on the other side. So I've done that right there, okay? Now you can do the body of the jacket. Let's start at the shoulder. You see the shoulder? Draw the shoulder, that's a shoulder. Now the body of the jacket goes straight down the armhole and then slightly fitted. See, it's a fitted jacket. See, I'm doing, see what I'm doing with my ruler? I'm manipulating it to create a slight curve. Not too curvy, okay? Do the same thing for the other side. Draw the shoulder and then draw 
the side and then I'm going just slightly inwards at the waist. See? Just a little fitted. It's a little more modern shape. Now we've got what missing here? The hem. Okay? So you want to draw the hem. So draw a straight line that then curves slightly up. Do the same thing here. Curve and then there. You've got a hem. Now, do you see how this crosses over right here? Erase it. Erase it, okay? Because that just hides underneath. So I've erased it and so it crosses over. See? So this lapel goes underneath. So you really want to just erase that. What goes in the center front? I'm going to draw this actual center front lightly. Your button. So one button, two button, right in the center front. And then the buttonhole sideways, like that. What's missing? Sleeves. Do a little bump right here at the cap, straight line down the arm, hem at the wrist, and back up. It's easy as that. Look at that. Do the same thing. A slight bump. What is the bump for? It's right here. It's for the shoulder pad, a little bit of a bump in the cap. And then draw down, wrist straight, and then the underseam straight up. There you are, okay? Now, what's missing? We've got a little chest pocket. So figure out where your chest is on the croquis. That's why you need the croquis. See, it's right here, chest number two. And then notice it's a little bit slanted. So then draw a rectangle. Just a slight little rectangle. I'm gonna draw it right here. <gasps> there you are. I could even draw my pocket scarf, but I won't, okay? What's missing now? It's fitted. Usually, if it's a fitted jacket, you need darts or a seam right here. This is how you draw it. This is how you show a fitted jacket. Right in the middle of it, right here, just draw this like that. That's your dart. And see how it follows the same line of the side seam? Do the same thing for the other side. Look, there you are. That's it. Now, if you really want to show that you're fancy, you can draw the inside. There's always a lining, a little pleat. So do this. That's your jacket. See, it's that easy. Now, I'm going to show you how to quickly draw the back. Okay, so now it's time to do the back of the men's fitted jacket or blazer. All right, so I have my croquis. This is the back croquis which I got from the book and you can get it from the book too. All right, take your piece of paper. See the croquis? It's got the back of the head, the neck, everything. All right, take your piece of paper and this is how you draw the back. Start with the halo again. That is the top. That's the top of your collar. Right at the top of the neck, just draw a line just like that. Okay? And then draw another line below it, just like that, a little longer, and then connect, connect, connect. What did I just draw? The collar, the back of the collar. All right? Now you're going to draw the body. Start with the shoulder. Draw the shoulder. See, I love it. You have your croquis right underneath. You know exactly where to go, what to do. All right? There's no guessing. There's no guessing. It's right there. There's the shoulder. Hello. All right? The body. Straight down, go away, a little bit away from the body, little fitted, and then go down around the hip level, okay? Which is about number four, maybe a little bit below the fourth head, all right? Do the same thing with the other side. Right away from the body, the waist, a little bit fitted, not too fitted. You don't want to do it too cinched, all right? It's not a corset, although I'm sure that you could do a men's corset, but this is a jacket. It's a fitted jacket, all right? Now we're going to do the hem, so watch. Just draw a straight line like that, okay? Now the sleeves. A little bump at the top for the cap, draw the outer, draw the wrist, and then the inner. Just follow the lines of the arms of your croquis, all right? Go down, wrist, connect, and then go back up. I mean, seriously, guys? Look, how easy is that? But we're not done. This is how you put the finishing touches, how you make your basic fitted jacket look like fabulous fitted jacket, all right? Every men's jacket, most men's jacket, have a center back seam. So how do you draw that? Like that. It's just a simple line. That's all it is. And you know why that seam is there? It's because it's fitted in the back, all right? And sometimes that's where the tailor goes in if you want to make it bigger or smaller, all right? Now, 
Also, you might find sometimes that there's a dart. So you do a little dart like that, right at the princess, and like that, and just stop. What else is missing? A vent, a back vent, an opening, all right? How do you draw this? It's right here. This is the trick. Watch. Do a little rabbit ear. It's like a little triangle, just like that. And then erase this, like that. And then bring this back down. And there you are. And then just lightly, with a broken line, draw lines just there. What does that show? That this flips open. There you are. Now, if you really want to impress your teacher or your boss, your designer boss, you draw a back arm seam right there, a sleeve. It's almost right at the middle, right there. And that really finishes the touches. That makes it almost look Savile Row. So there's your back. Oh, wait, you thought you were done? But no, you wanna double impress your designer boss or your instructor? You wanna add this to the back of the sleeve. You see how you don't see it here? See, you don't see it. You see it in the back. So let's go to the back sketch right here where the seam is and go button, button, button and little broken line. <gasps> Ooh, child. Button, button, button. Little broken line. There you are. Now, of course, you get all of those tips and tricks in my book, but you got it here in my video. Thanks for watching Fashion School with Nick Varios. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share. And don't forget to get my book, A Comprehensive Guide to Men's Flat Sketching. It's available on Amazon.com.